Hey, what's going on, everybody? I am bringing you a sneak peek of my Sunrise Sunset uh, code for my LED lighting. I've been... I wrote it and figured it should work, you know, and, and it wouldn't work, and it wouldn't work, and I double-checked the code, double-checked it again, and it, would, it just seemed like it could work, and I couldn't understand why it wasn't working. So what I did is I isolated it. I pulled it out of my controller build sketch, my controller build code, and wrote it on its own. So it's only the sunrise sunset. I don't get the time. I'm not going to get temperature. Uh, but I'll figure that out in the future. So I just wanted to give you a sneak peek at what it looks like. This is its first run. There are some mistakes in the matrix, and I can smooth it out a little bit. There are a couple pros and cons, too. Uh, Pros, the dimming is really seamless and really silky smooth. I really like that. Uh, one of the cons, it just didn't live up to what the picture I had in my head. Uh, I really had it, the picture of uh, some, you know, going across the tank. And it kind of does it, but not as vividly as my imagination had it. I thought for sure that, you know, it would be more dramatic, a more dramatic look of a sunrise coming going across the tank. It is only a three foot tank. If it was longer, I'm sure it would be better. And I can still work on the lighting matrix a bit and get that, uh, you know, tweak it here and there. Uh, part of the sunset, I made a mathematics uh, mistake, so when you're watching it, it does hang on the very last channel. It hangs there for a long time. I, uh, added instead of subtracted so instead of starting three minutes in it's into the previous string it starts three minutes after the last string ended and that's not how I wanted it to go so it kind of hangs there for three minutes all by itself on before it eventually starts to fade but you all get the idea and this is going to be your sneak peek into my Arduino sunrise sunset code
one cool thing about that cleanup crew that I just got in yesterday. Check this out. I don't know if we're going to be able to pick this up. You definitely can see it, but not too clear. All right, so there's the trail, and it goes all the way up the wall there. One of the Florida Sarah snails, one of the big girls, laid eggs on her very first day. So I may just triple the size of my cleanup crew here for the price of $40. I just thought that that was pretty cool. I don't know if they'll hatch. I don't know if she was just dropping them because of the stress of transport. You don't really hear too much about stress on inverts. You hear it about on fish all the time. But uh, that is one hell of a long trail of eggs. But you all saw my sunrise sunset code. I will be tweaking it to make it a little smoother. And uh, another step in the right direction. I just have to figure out how I'm going to plug it in to my uh, controller build. Because right now it's independent and it's got to be part of the controller build. And I just don't know what's hanging it up. And uh, maybe somebody out there can let me know how to insert that. Because I'm starting to get lots of hits on the Arduino side of things. So if anybody lets me know, comment, rate, subscribe. And we'll catch you all later.